Hello, my lovely people, your girl Nanash here, and thank you for coming back. In today's video, I want to show you step-by-step -step on how to start freelance teaching if you are in Turkey. Without wasting much time, let's dive into it. So first of all, the site we are going to look at is called sahibinden.com. So you can either write it this way and search or you write sahibinden dot com dot tr so we are here and we will click on the first result that comes here after clicking on it you are going to get something like this i'm already signed in but i will sign out so i will take you through on how to get started so first of all you check up here obviously some adverts will come and you just have to ignore it you can either translate your page or if you are good at Turkish, you leave it that way. So up here we have open accounts. If you can see my case very well, up on your right, you see open account and also log in. If you don't have an account, you click on open account. And here you have several options to choose from. You can either enter your email account or you connect directly with your Google account. But since I already have an account, I'm going to log in. My account is there already, so I'm going to log in. And after logging in, this is what you are going to see. Let's wait. This is what you are going to see after logging in. So you can still translate this page, or if your Turkish is good, you can continue with it, but let's translate. So you will come here, advertise now. That is where you start after logging in. You will see this interface, take note of it very well. And then you come here, advertise now. After clicking on advertise now, we have different services here, estate, vehicle, whatever. But yours is teaching. It doesn't matter, it can be English, it can be any other subject. So we, we are going to select private tutors. After selecting private tutors, we have a range of options for you to select from. But what are you interested in? If you're interested in teaching at the university or high school, you could equally select it. But we are interested in teaching English. So English is a foreign language. So we are going to select foreign language. After selecting foreign language, you click what? Continue, yes. Then it will bring you to this page. After clicking continue, it is going to bring you to this page. This is where you will write who you are, your profile and everything. For instance, the title, you are going to write English teacher, like English teacher as your title. English teacher, which is okay. And then you will come here. In the space here, you are going to explain and say more about yourself. It doesn't matter whether you have experience or not. You can start talking about how bilingual you are and since when did you start learning English and how fluent in English you are. If you have experience too, you can equally add it. I'm going to write something small here for the purpose of this video. So this is just for the purpose of this video and you can write more and more and more as you want. Make sure to check that everything is correct and you are good to go. Now, this is where you set your price. If you are doubting and you don't know the amount to set, you can equally come here to check the prices of other tutors. And also when we started, we saw prices here. So if you really trust yourself or you believe yourself, then you can equally go for a price that is higher. If you want a lot of people to reach you, you can go for a price that is lower. 
So let's say we are charging or we want to take 150 Turkish Lira per hour. So we will select the location. For the beginning, if you're just starting, I will encourage you to make it online or, yes, on online is perfect. But if you want to, you can either go to the student's house and then you tell who you are, whether you are a male or a female. This is where you write your address. So you write your address here. I'm just picking anything for the purpose of this video. So we come, what language are you going to teach? Are you going to teach other languages? We are interested in teaching English. So we are going to search for English and we are going to select English. After selecting, you now go down and scroll down. We have picture. You can add your photo here. I don't think it is compulsory, but it will increase your chances of getting students. So if you are comfortable, you can add your picture. And if you have a short video of yourself, you can equally add it down here. And that one will increase your visibility as well as the number of people that will reach out to you. So after filling all those information, you wouldn't forget to enter your contact details as well. That is where people will reach out to you. Then we will tick here, I have read and agree to the rules for placing ad. We now continue. This is where we review everything that we have written so far. So you will see all the information you have written in the previous section. Remember, if you have photos, you can go back and add it. If you don't want to add photos, it's up to you. So whilst you have checked and you are sure that everything is okay, this is where we move to the real deal. Take note of this. You go on. So after continuing, we see the next step we are going into is called doping. And doping is where you are going to give your ad. You can equally translate it. So doping, we are going to, how long do you want your ad to be run? That is what the doping means. And here you are going to select the amount of money you are going to pay for your adverts so that it can get to a lot of people and they will reach out to you. So always you can pick the smaller ones since you are just starting. You can pick um, on the top. You want to appear on the top, you pick it. And maybe detail, um, detailed search showcase, you want to also be there, you can pick it. You don't have to pick all of them. Definitely people are going to reach out to you. So this two is okay. Or if you want, you can add this, the three of them, and it's barely 200 teller. So you are going to go on. Mind you, this site is legit. And I've had a student from this particular site for like three years now, and I'm still teaching that particular student. So if you are serious, when you get your students, you try and do your best. And I bet you that student is going to like you for a long time, especially when you get the children. Some of the parents come here and then after doing, you enter your card information and then you make the payment. After making the payment, sit down and relax. People are going to reach out to you. Those that are serious, you take them serious. Those that are not serious, try to ignore them. And I will leave the link to this site in the description box. Also, follow me for I have more in stock for you. Thank you for watching. See you another time. Bye.